welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am back yet again with my friend Mia. And today we are going to be doing a lingerie haul. So I hope you guys are ready. And you guys can follow me at IamMia1 underscore on both Instagram and TikTok. And it's at IamMia1 on YouTube. And I would really love it if you guys want to follow me. Yes. All her information will also be in the description box below in case you would need some help getting that link. Okay. Let's get started. The first set that I'm going to be trying on is this purple set, which is super adorable. It's really cute. I really like this. The frills, the hearts, the bow detail. I think it's adorable. It is. It's very feminine. Like, mm -hmm. and lingerie is obviously feminine, but it's so... I don't know how to explain it. It's just so bubbly. So girly and cute. Yeah. yeah. I think it's adorable. I love this. Yeah. And then your one, and looking very sexy. Yes, I have a completely like see-through lace uh, baby doll, I guess you would call it, like a little dress. Um, I think it's fun, and uh, you can adjust the straps on it, so you know, that's good. But we're gonna see what it looks like. Okay, so this is what this one looks like on, and I haven't worn this in a really long time, and I forgot how cute it was actually. And I think it fits really nicely. like. It's cute. It feels really secure. Like it's it's holding my boobs nice. Like I just want to do this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I feel that. I yeah. can see that. But like it looks really good as it's well. It's perfect for Valentine's Day. Yeah, it's very cute. I like it. The hearts, the color, everything. Yeah. I like this a lot. And I like the back too. It's very like minimal. A little triangle. And I just love these bows. They are so cute. I would wear that for my favorite person. Yeah. <laughs> this one is it's cute like too. Um, I will say it's very sexy because it is completely see-through up here, but I almost feel like it's so comfortable. I would probably wear this as a pajama. Right? Yeah. I'm not gonna lie, the nipple covers being the black hearts look amazing with it. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah, they do. Like, you know what? You can see the whole heart. It actually looks like it's part of the thing. Oh, I love so cool. that. I didn't look in the mirror before putting it on. But actually from here, yeah, you're right. Yeah, the black like, it looks like it's part of it. It looks so cute. Yeah, it's actually, I didn't think it, I thought it was going to be a little itchy because of like this material, but it's yeah. so soft. It's like, like, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. It's like a net. I don't even yeah. know. But I think it's so cute. cute. I love it. Cute little, cute little tiny oh, bows right here. Yeah. yeah. But super nice. It's so good. It's so cute. Okay, so Desi, I have a question for you, and I absolutely love this question, I can't wait to hear her answer. What would you do to get out of a bad day? <laughs> oh. um, I would probably do either one of two things. Actually, no. Because I was going to say right off the bat, I'd tell my friend to call me and say she has an emergency, but that's such an obvious move mm -hmm. that I wouldn't right. want to be there. So I would literally probably just like order an appetizer and be like, oh my god, I feel so sick. Like, I don't know what that was, but I'm okay. going to literally be sick to my stomach. I'm going to have to go home. I'm so sorry. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. Is, that, is yeah. that obvious? I don't know, because I feel like when you, if that's what you're doing, you think about it too much and it look, you feel like it's too obvious. Yeah. But it could happen. That it could. It could happen. Yeah. Even the emergency friend one, like, it could happen. What? Imagine if that actually happens to you on a date. And you'll be like, I'm so sorry, I'm not trying to get out of this date. Like, I genuinely have an emergency that I have to go to. Yeah. So it could happen, but I know what you mean. You know what? I probably maybe instead of having a friend call me, I'd be like, "Mom, tell me you just lost my dog or something." Like, like tell me that you opened the door and he ran out the front, and now you can't find him. I'll be like, yeah. "Yo, goodbye." But the problem there is, what if he's like, "I'll come and help you," because you don't you don't want to be like, "No," because you need help finding it. If it's that much of an emergency, you'd be like, "Thank you, let's go." Yeah, you're right. But if he should, if he wants to come and help, then you'd be like. <laughs> you're right. I mean, you see, I would have blown my cover right there because I wouldn't have thought of that. Okay, my next one, I actually have borrowed this from my friend Riss. You guys know Riss. <laughs> and she let me have this because I said how much I loved it and I love the blue color. So she let me have this. I'm going to show you guys what it looks like on me. I'm quite excited. It looks really cool. I love the blue color. Yeah, I like it. It looks like it's going to give you a lot of shape. Yeah. Totally, I love that. Yeah. This is a two-piece. I got it on Sheen. 
Um, I love this bra because it's like really heavily padded. It's definitely like... I can like, see from the inside, there's a lot going on in there. Yeah, this is like a, a push-up bra and it does its job. So I love that with the adjustable blue straps. And then it comes with this matching thong. Um, my cheeks swallow this up, so yeah, you're gonna see that. <laughs> I love that. It's cute. The lace is see-through through the yeah. front, so extra I'm sexy. I'm obsessed with this. I love the pink, I love the blue, the design, the bows, everything. I, I can't wait to see what this looks like. Oh, I really need to talk about this <laughs> straight away. <laughs> I'm going first. Yeah. Actually, I got her in a size medium because I knew that the bra, I wanted the bra to fit perfectly. I can actually put her looser, but whatever, I put her on the tightest thing. Yeah. Um, and I was afraid that the bottoms were like not gonna fit. They're a little tight, but I just like rise them up a little bit and then you know. I think you got the perfect size. Like, I think it does, yeah. yeah I love her. Thanks. She's very comfortable, actually. Yeah. So I typically don't like like underwear that's not cotton, but this is it's pretty good. Okay, with the bow. And it's matching blue on the top right. And, yeah. and I love how the bow is like blue and pink, blue lace, the pink. I am so obsessed. Like I've already said to her, like send me the link when we're done because I need this. <laughs> this was literally no more than like six dollars. I'm obsessed. That's that. I'm so obsessed with that. Look, I feel like I don't even want to talk about mine. I'm like, <laughs> no, <laughs> this is nice too. Like I really like this detail. I don't know, I think it just adds something to it. Yeah, it adds a little pizzazz. Yeah, it's not just a plain bodysuit. And yeah, I really like it. It's see-through, it's comfortable, it's giving me a big wedgie, I will say, at the back. I like, I feel like I'm going to be pulling it out all the time. But obviously it's lingerie, so it's not like, it's not like I'm going to be walking down the street and it's pulling out a wedgie, so yeah. Yeah, I think the back is cute. I like it, it sits nice and high on my hips. That's also good. I love that. It yeah, it's super cute. <laughs> I love that they're like almost the same shade of blue. Right. <laughs> My next question for you is, if you were invisible for 24 hours, what would you do? <laughs> Oh my god, this is gonna sound so bad. I don't know if I want to say the truth. <laughs> <laughs> you need to say it now. Um, you can't do that and then not say it. <laughs> I would stalk certain people. Okay. I would. Okay. Certain just, people being... Would I be able to get access to like anybody? I mean, you're invisible, so technically, yeah. You're probably some celebrities. Okay. And yeah, I'd stalk okay. them. Definitely. Yeah, that would be, you know what I would love, that would be so cool if you're invisible to just go to like the neighborhood that has all the celebrities houses and just go check them out, you know? Yeah. Just go in and be like, oh, I like this house. Yeah, like, what do you like, do on a day doing? day? Yeah, see what they're doing. Because like, you know how like they always, people always say like, a, like they have a billionaire's routine so that they can wake up at five in the morning, they like read and meditate. I would want to fact check all of you. Right, I want to check that out for yeah. sure. Mm -hmm. I want to be there at five a.m. like, you're still sleeping. Yes, like your alarm didn't go off until 8. <laughs> yeah, that's what I think. Yeah, I love that. My next one, the bra is very simple. It's like the cozy style bra. There's nothing really too sexy going on, but it, it looks good. It looks good. The sexiness comes from the bottom, which is a thong with like a red heart gem. Just trying to get it around the right way. But it's at the back, so it's very sexy. It looks very, very good. I can't wait to show you guys what this looks like on. Huh? Yeah, those stones are super pretty. This is gonna be a like a more, I don't wanna call it modest, because when I put it on, you're gonna see it's completely see-through, but it is like a little lingerie dress. Um, it has like a little lace trim. Um, these are like little tulips, I think that's what these are called. Yeah, yeah. these are tulips. Yeah. And then on the side, they actually scrunch. Mm -hmm. You can't adjust the scrunch, but I don't know, I think it's super cute. And it has, again, like the lace, tra lace trim on the bottom. So. I'm really excited to see what this looks like on, because I can definitely see that like right now, it looks a bit modest, it looks a bit square, you know, like it doesn't look like much, but I think when it's on, it's gonna look amazing. Yes. Yeah. So my one, like I said, the top is very like cozy, cute, it's quite full coverage, you know, like, Nothing pushing up, it's just pretty much just to cover up my boobs, I guess. Um, the bottom though, like I said, is where the sexiness is at. From the front, it's quite simple, you know. You can't tell there's much going on. It does, the string part does start really early, so I'm like, 
so aware to like not open my legs basically, so yeah. I love it's it. Like that. And then the back is yeah. Great. That back is amazing. Like it's so pretty. I love it. And it's adjustable too, which is really cool. Oh that is um, super cool. Yeah, so you can kind of just put it anywhere really, which is nice. But yeah, the gems, adorable. Yeah, I would literally wear that with like just pasties. Like if I was gonna wear it for my significant other, I'd literally yeah. put it on with just some pasties. And yeah, yeah, that would be cute. yeah, that's so yeah. hot. And this little pink set is so cute. I love it. Yeah, this is um really soft as well, kind of like the black outfit. The material of it, for some reason, not the lace, but the actual pink part of it, is so soft and pretty. Um, I love it. It's definitely not like as sexy as some other lingerie. I love the scrunch. I love that it has scrunch at the back. Like you never see stuff like this with a scrunch. Yeah, it's so cool. Yeah, it's scrunch on both sides and then on the booty part. Yeah, I love that. And I love the the boob part too. Oh yeah, yeah, it's got like a little separate thing right yeah. here. There's it yeah. provides a little bit of support. If you like adjust yeah. the straps up here, you can kind of you know. But I love her. She's so cute, right? Yeah, I love that. My next question for you is, if you could run the world, what would be the first thing you would change? If I could run the world, what would be the first thing that I would change? Oh my god, I have no idea. <laughs> um, I'm trying to think of like world problems. Like, I feel like I'd definitely do something for animals. Okay. Like, I don't know what exactly, but I... I love fix, animals. Yes, like I'm, I love nature, I love animals, and like it would definitely have something to do with that. Okay. Yeah. That's very cute. I love like that. Okay, and my final piece, so it's actually just the thong that I wanted to show. So I got a plain black bra to show it with. So nothing special in the bra, it's just a black shop bra. <laughs> but the bottom is what I really wanted to show, and it is a black thong with at the front looking quite simple, but at the back it's got like this triangle gold chain that has a pearl and it says love. I think it's gonna look a little cool. better. Yeah, I love that so much. I think it's gonna look really cute. I'm excited about this one. It feels like it's gonna look really classy. Yeah, I hope so. I hope yeah. so. I have something similar because um, it's black. It's a like. So I think this is a G-string. I mean, it's not a string, but it practically is. Yeah. It has like a little tiny part here that's what do you even call that? Corset style. Yeah. Kind yeah, I would of. Say so. Yeah. yeah. And then the matching top is just completely lace. It is going to be a little see-through. Um, doesn't have any padding on it, so I don't know how much support it's going to provide, but I'm excited. It looks I'm pretty excited. cute. It looks cute. Very classy. Yeah. Very this I also got from Sheen for like $3 and change. So that. Yeah. We love Sheen for <laughs> everything. <laughs> Apparently mine is very nice. She's seeing it from the back. I, uh, it's I know. perfect. Really? Yes. Like it's Ooh, literally. Okay, I, I can see it from here. That, that does look really cute. I think. Yeah. You need to take some pictures of that. I do. <laughs> <laughs> this is the front. Obviously, not much going on in the front. It just looks like black thong, black bra. So yeah, not much going on. I guess I should probably talk. For the rest of the video, like this. Because the party's so the cool back. Way. Yeah. <laughs> is it comfortable? Like with the yeah. material? It, it actually is. is. Like, it feels like a regular thong. Like, I don't feel like there's. It doesn't feel like there's literally like metal or whatever this is back here. It feels very comfortable. It's so beautiful. Like, I can't get over it. <laughs> I love this. Yes. I can see yeah, it in the reflections that I can see. It looks really good. Yes. I love it. 10 out of 10. Now, this one, I just noticed as I put it on that the design on the bottom is different from the top. So that was a little weird. Um, I do like that the bra actually does provide some support. Like it does kind of feel yeah, like. Yeah, you can tell. Yeah, like holds yeah. in place. So I like that. Um, other than that, the, the top is actually kind of itchy in the bottom. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. It's like okay. itchy, like when my arms rub against the sides. I feel oh, like. Okay. It, yeah, I wouldn't. Mm. So. This we're one's not, gonna be not doing too well. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> this, this is like the only outfit I really didn't like, but yeah. I mean, it's yeah. the back is cute. I will say the back of that with that corset style bit. Yeah. That, that's cute. That is really really cute. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, I feel like and yeah, at least she has that. You know. Yeah. <laughs> I 
Okay, like what? Well, one out of ten? Like that gives it the one point, and then the rest is just. Yeah, I mean the blog also gets like one point, so okay. maybe like a two out of ten. Two out of ten. <laughs> yeah, but the song is. It good. looks good. I will say it looks good. I guess yeah. I just I know what you mean. It's not matching. Yeah. If it's if it feels uncomfortable, then. Yeah. Yeah. So. Well, my, what's funny is my next question is gonna be what gives you the ick and I feel like it's gonna be the bra. <laughs> itchy clothes. <laughs> itchy clothes gives me the ick. Um, do I, is this like ick in like relationships or ick in general? Um, you can do in general I think, yeah. Okay, so what gives me the most ick is like when you meet someone and then they are very obviously lying about certain aspects of okay. their life to like, like seem that. cooler. <laughs> That's actually happened to me like two or three times in the last few weeks, and I'm just like, it's so obvious. Mm -hmm. Like, and why? Why? Like, yeah, like you do not need to like be a millionaire to be accepted. You don't have to like hang out with celebrities. Like, that's not gonna make me think absolutely anything differently about you. Yeah. So, yeah, that would give you the okay. Yeah, you. I I definitely agree with that. I think people they. They think that everyone is judging them all the time, but usually if you judge yourself, people will like you more, so why lie? Yeah. yeah. Um, for me, the ick is usually just, it's kind of similar, but like cockiness, like overconfidence, like arrogance. Think, yeah, thinking you're much better than you actually are, but in reality, we're all humans on the same level. When you first meet someone, you should, you know, you're not any better than the person you're next to, you know? Yep. Like, you're just a human being at the end of the day, and I think, yeah, over cockiness just really puts me off someone, like, uh, whether it's friend, partner, like, anything, I'll just not want to hang around with you if you're just, it's so embarrassing when you're with someone that's really super cocky as well, when you meet people, you can see that they're, like, also, like, who makes this person think they are, and you're there, like, I'm so they usually, those type of people also don't make for good friends because mm -hmm. they're so self-absorbed mm -hmm. that they just don't ever ask about you, they yeah. don't, they, they just want to talk about themselves, like their accomplishments, so yeah, those type of people are not fun to be around. Yeah, I would agree. So don't do that. <laughs> and that's going to be a wrap for today, you guys. I hope you enjoyed our haul. Like I mentioned in the beginning of the video, all the links to everything will be in the description box along with her information. So you can follow Mia on Instagram, on um, YouTube, and on her spicy site. <laughs> so yes, uh, don't forget to like this video, leave us a comment letting us know which one was your favorite outfit, and subscribe, you guys. It means the world. Until next time.